right, here we go. Next up so the Garden Gauntlet. Uh, I really don't like my opponent's bands. All right, I'm, I'm Delir. All right, as long as we get beads. Beads first relic. I think we can do this. Now, one thing about this matchup that I got a lot of comments on in the first video, which was why aren't you ulting, right? Why, why wasn't I ulting? Well, the problem is with this matchup is if I ult, Heim Delir can time his ult to get the CC Muti and ult me at the same time, at the very end of it. So basically my ult is useless and his ult is just, I, he still gets the full effect of his ult, which is why, I'm gonna try going boots first. I think I need mobility, which is why I feel like I can only use my ult when his ult's down. Now that's okay. If I'm not using my ult because he's not using his ult, and which means he's saving his ult as well, that's good. His ult's better than mine. If he's not using his ult, that's good. If he does use his ult, and then I can use my ult effectively, or at least get his beats. We're going to Assassin's Blessing start into boots this time. I'm not gonna pick up the speed buff. I'm gonna pick up blue buff because I don't have any mana potions. I went to Chalice. Yeah, so I didn't give up on this challenge, by the way. I just put it on pause because I just kind of had to figure out things with Guardians on this map and different strategies and all that. And although I found more, unfortunately, Ares is a lot worse on this map. So once we win with Ares, it should be smooth sailing. Like, Ardia's good. Athena's good. A lot of the other gods are good. So it should be smooth sailing after. I don't know how good this Heimdallir is. Just hoping he's not that good. Oh, he screwed up that teleport, but oh well. Kind of was taking too much damage. I do have knock up immunity, which is nice. I hate that those autos hit me so easily. Nice thing with uh, Assassin's Blessing is we can heal off these buffs. Which is kind of nice. There's a good amount of healing. Decent amount. It's like a potion. So he has beads as well. Maybe I can get them here because his... Because his ult's not up yet. Yep, there we go. So beads. Now I still have beads for his ult, which is good. Really hard to position myself to kill these minions without taking too much damage from him. Kind of hard to do that. And like, even there, I did a lot of damage to him, but I took even more from minions, and now he has more minions. So he's gonna clear faster than me, which is really bad. He's level five. We're both out of potions. Hmm. That was a close call. I do think I have to recall. He's going for his blue. You know what, if he's going for his blue, I have enough time to take red. I have Assassin's Blessing. We're doing it. I'm playing risky. He has vision of me. Plus, I heal off this, so... Okay, got red buff. Looks like he's coming to me, though. Uh oh I screwed that up. Alright, good. <laughs> Knew he was gonna do that once he placed that crystal. I do have beads, so if I could bait his all, I could probably kill him, but... Ah. Uh. It's like just a few chains and he's dead. No. Oh. Nice backstep. Very nice backstep. Backstepping is a good way to juke. At this point, we should just back, though. Scream. Um, I'm gonna go Emperors. Because we actually are seem to be holding off in the early game. If I get Emperors online, that could help us a lot with our push as well as our defense. Okay, he's not taking my buff. That's good. Should probably went for my speed, but kind of needed to kill these minions. I'm gonna put more points on my three. My, my he seems to doing a good job at dodging his chains even though he's like Honduras should be an easy guy to hit with chains your opponent has the jukes it's not 
not the easiest. Now, my question is, does he know the Heimdallir timing to ult, to get the CC immunity and to ult me? You have to do it at the very end. If he knows that, then we, then we can't be ulting very much. But if he doesn't know that, then we can ult whenever we please. Let's see. Does he do it? Yep. But it's a good bait into getting him really close so I can use the rest of my abilities. So he does know it, though. You notice I had to use my beats. He did not have to use beats. He only had to ult. And he would have launched me. Alright. Maybe I should have gotten power boots. Alright, alright. What's the stats for Sob? Just curious. Increases, so that would be... It'd be 60 defense. Gives 15 HP 5. Not good for dual, but still. Oh, a little bit of lag. No, I don't take this. Yes. Ha ha ha. Having secure over red buff is pretty big. Pretty big. I do need to take, be taking more buffs, but... Like, if I, if I had taken my speed, I would have missed red buff. So, kind of does make sense what I'm doing. Only thing is I'm not going to have Breastplate for the cooldown, but that's okay. I think Emperors could just be good. Good for pushing and good for defense. I miss Old Spirit Mages. Would be able to do so much damage to him this matchup. So much damage. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I don't have my beats. If I live here, that would be amazing. Got his beats. Very bad. Very bad fight, but I lived. Extraordinarily bad fight. Is he going Debos? No. I mean, I'm getting, I need to go into a pen item right away. I can go Spear? Even though Spear is not as good as it used to be, it still could be good against Heimdallir. Oh wow, that's already tower. Doesn't matter, I got Emperors. That sucks! But it's not like I could have stayed. I don't know what he's doing, he's waiting. Yeah. Can I still kill him, I hope? That's good. First blood. Unfortunately, he killed all my minions and I can't do anything. <laughs> That's okay. That's okay. Ooh, not having life still is pretty rough. Not having life still is very rough. I've been... Oh, shoot. Forgot about that. I have been uh, practicing Typhoon's his vision on me. And I do not have vision on him. Oh god. Thank goodness he can't hit me. Oh, he stayed! I could have ulted him through the wall. No one Not that I probably would have wanted to, but... I'm also upgrading beads. Upgrade beads so he can't just, you know, ult me, get my beads, and ult me again. He's getting tight in Spain, so let's not go double defense, that's for sure. Red buff is up. And he is going to be going for it. I gotta clear this minion wave. I don't want him to get red buff, but there's way too many minions here to ignore. Yeah. I think I made the right choice, though. I do have speed buff here, though. Nope. 
We are ahead just ever so slightly. Super, super, super fast. Oh, that's bad. Bad that I missed out. Insane the amount of damage this guy does. No, that looked like it was going to hit. No. No, 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 no. I tried to juke it. I really tried to juke it. Is that enough for him to get Phoenix? Please don't tell me it is. Say it ain't so. I'm just gonna get Sunder against this guy. That's like the only way I'm gonna kill him. Upgrade Sunder with all my damage. Your Phoenix is under hey, you didn't get Phoenix, so that's good. Alright, so we're one and one. This is, seems like a fair fight so far. I like how Emperor sometimes hurts me. Like, I lose extra minions there, but oh well. I see his one, so I'm guessing he used it at BDK. No? Okay. Look out for spies. Guess not. Yes! <laughs> uh, does Empress not apply to Phoenix if Tower's not dead? I just... The, the, that Phoenix was shooting at full force. Is that intentional? Did I just find a bug or is that intentional? I can, I can understand why that would be intentional. But I'm pretty sure Empress was not applying to that Phoenix. If I would have died due to do that, I would have been very sad. He does have his teleport. Oh, he didn't use it though. I can't. Can't take it, but I, that, there's always next time. Always next time. I have to run all the way home. Probably have to use my beads or my ult. I guess not. Oh, I'm dead anyway, so. Yeah. <laughs> Where is my team? Not much I could have done there. Not much I could have done. Oh, uh, I'll try a gem. Yeah, he's gonna take it. Man, I'm trying my best. I really am. I will say this. If my Empress would have applied to that Phoenix, I wouldn't have taken as much damage. I probably wouldn't be able to get away. I don't know. If, I guess, guess that's intentional, and I just didn't know about that. Like, it, it would make sense. The item's designed so to help you take objectives that you can actually take. So if tower's still up, it shouldn't really apply to Phoenix. Just kind of wish I knew that. I'm going to be getting a gem just because his jukes are pretty good. And if I can keep him from juking and get more damage. Also going to upgrade this Sunder. Close game, at least. Very close game, within 100 gold. This tower is nearly down, so... Very close game. He's at his blue buff right now. We are gonna need a ward and make sure he doesn't place a crystal in a weird spot. your enemies closer. Ah, he actually stole that. Oh, we got ants on the runic shield. Okay. Hey, can you not do all my health? Thank you. Oh, then beads in time. Rip. Oh, that guy is just a bully. 
That con is just a bully, straight up. I just lose. I just lose. There's nothing I can do. I just straight up lose. Okay. I didn't realize it charges that fast. And. Uh, it's a close game at least. I tried my best. I really did. I don't have anything up. This game. That was a close call. That will make them scream. Your title is under attack. Uh, I tried my best. There is it's just so rough with Aries on this map. I'm not giving up on this challenge. I'll keep trying. GG well played. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. I will make it work with Ares. It's just... Uh, I just gotta win with Ares, and then we can get through the rest of the Guardians. Through a breeze. Just rough that his items... That Ares item choices are so bad.